I'm not really that upset, and I'm not upset because I'm coming back. So although there is a sense of nostalgia about the morning, uh, it's a really, it's a positive move, you know, we're going away, we're coming back again. And uh, I keep telling myself that, and I packed up yesterday, and I set to the task with, with gusto, and I thought, well, this will be nice, and I'll get rid of the stuff I don't want, which I did. And uh, the more I packed, the worse and worse I felt. And um, it's the change, you see. It's the change that I think makes us feel so uneasy. But it was a very positive feeling of unpositiveness. If you know what I mean. And that unpositive feeling of, or the positiveness about the unpositiveness was how much obviously I have enjoyed living here. I took down my little golf net from outside my window and Craig leant on his windowsill and peered out said, what are you doing? He had noticed that there was one there before, of course, but now he has, and now it's gone. And it was all just kind of, um, it showed me how much I had settled uh, over here, over the last two years, and it made me feel very sort of uh, homely about the place, which is great. And I know that many of you feel the same. I've no doubt that you are going to have that same feeling, though, when we go to, or when we spend an extended period in the Mara, when we've got a regular feed coming out of there, when you start to learn all about the characters that we have there, and we learn a whole new ecosystem. And I always find that when I go to a new place, uh, especially a wilderness area, which can be quite intimidating, and they can be intimidating because there are things around that you don't understand that are potentially unsafe, potentially dangerous, unfamiliar, you just, things are unfamiliar. And I always find when I go to a new wilderness area that feeling is amplified and it takes a while for it to sort of go away, to calm down and then to be replaced by a feeling of, ah yes, this is, this is nice, this is homish. And um, well, that's how it happened to me here at Juma. All right, everyone, that is going to be it from the Sunrise Safari today. There will be a Sunset Safari. I will be absent today, of course. However, Taylor will be on it. I think Ali will also be on it, so that'll be great. And the crew at Juma, I'm going to wish them a very fond farewell and an, an adieu, because I will see you, of course, all in roughly three months. So until then, I say bye-bye from Juma, and I will see the rest of you in two weeks from the Mara. Until then, bye-bye. <laughs>